Welcome to Rage X Mods, the channel that's dedicated to bringing you step-by-step -step tutorials and ROM reviews. Today I'm going to be doing a quick guide on how to back up and restore your phone quickly during the changing of ROMs. I've been getting a lot of questions about Titanium Backup, so this will include a brief tutorial on that portion of the app, as well as how to back up and restore your home screens with the help of a third-party launcher, saving you a lot of time and energy. If you're a flashaholic like myself, then you probably already know how to do this, so this is mainly for people who are new to modding their X. So let's say you're going from one ROM to another that requires a data wipe. You'll want to make sure that your apps are backed up as well as your home screens. You need to download Titanium Backup and Titanium Backup Pro Key in the market. It costs a couple dollars, but it's well worth it. You also need to download either ADW or Launcher Pro from the market to back up and restore your home screens. I prefer Launcher Pro, but both work very much the same. Once you have the new launcher installed and running, you'll need to set up your home screens on this launcher, and if everything goes as planned, you won't ever need to do this again. After you have your screens set up the way you like them, go to the menu into the launcher. Find the launcher's backup option and select it. Now open Titanium Backup and give it super user access when it requests it. Press Menu and then press Batch. Press Run next to the column that says Backup All User Apps. Now press Run the Batch Operation. When that finishes, we're ready to wipe the data and install the ROM. Once I'm done with that, I'll be back to show you the restoral on the new ROM. After most ROM installations, Google will ask if you want to restore your apps. You can choose to let it or use Titanium. Just a side note, Google should restore your contacts no matter what you choose. Either way, it's good to have it as a secondary option. If you choose to use Titanium, this is what you'll do. Obviously, you'll need to download and install Titanium Backup and the key for it in the market again. Open Titanium Backup and press Menu, then press Batch. Now press Run next to Restore Missing Apps with Data. Now press Run the Batch Operation. You'll probably want to set the phone down for a bit to allow them to restore, which will take a few minutes. Once the status bar shows that it's done, press the home button and you'll be asked what launcher to use. Choose whichever you have installed, ADW or Launcher Pro. Press menu and then either preferences or ADW settings depending on what launcher you have. Now find your launcher's restore option and press it. You'll need to restart your launcher for it to take effect. Something else that I wanted to mention about Titanium Backup is that it not only restores your apps, but it also restores the data of the apps. This means that all of the settings and sign-in credentials are restored with the app. That's all there is to it. You'll still need to manually add your widgets due to restrictions within the phone, but this is minimal work compared to redoing everything. If this video helped you, please make sure you subscribe for more step-by-step -step tutorials and ROM reviews.